as most of you know by now, my name is Brother Larry, and I'm about realism-ism, that's the truth, with no bullshit in it. First of all, I don't believe in spooky stuff, so I can't go with all that rest in peace and all of that. Nah, it's not time to rest in peace. Brother man was executed for violating a taxation rule in a market. A taxation rule in a market. They allege that he was selling cigarettes. That is a violation of a taxation rule in a market. Cigarettes are a market commodity. They are taxed by the state. They get a stamp. And if you have a tax ID, you can sell them. Retail or wholesale. It's a business. It is tobacco. They brought our ancestors here to pick that shit. Real talk. Tobacco was the cash crop before cotton and remains so to this day. If you don't believe me, all you dudes out there smoking weed, look on them goddamn Dutch cigars that you buy. Look at the picture on the Dutch cigars that you smoke. You will see Dutch masters. That's Dutch slave masters. I would suggest you pay attention. Like I said, realism-ism. The truth with no bullshit in it. Now, it is most unfortunate and regrettable that that brother was murdered in that manner. A father gone. Brother gone. A son gone. A man gone. For violating a taxation act in a market. Now, the value placed on that brother's life is a direct reflection of the market value placed on us in this society. Let us not forget, we were brought to this market to be exploited. The dynamics have never changed for our people. Some of us have learned to exploit, creating the illusion that we are co-equal participators in this market. It's not real. Don't fall for the tricks. Don't go for the mind games and tricks because you will wind up being choked to death for violating a taxation rule in a market. Now, it is inconceivable that that would have occurred had that been a Caucasian member of this society. It is inconceivable that that would have occurred if that would have been another ethnic minority of this society. But we see that it regularly happens with our people. And I have to really question Brothers, where your heart at? You dying anyway. And you're not fighting back. You see, brother man died and brother man was not fighting. That's why it's murder. Brother man was not fighting. See now, I would suggest that nobody go willingly. You don't just submit. You fight for your life. You have the right to stand your ground. 
You have the right to defend your life. You have the right to attack anyone who is attacking you. This is Brother Larry. This is realism-ism. I have the right to defend my life. And I will do so uncompromisingly. I have no problem destroying anyone attempting to do me harm. Realism-ism. I pull a trigger. I plunge a knife. And I swing a pipe. In a heartbeat. With no hesitation. And no regrets. For the consequences that I be facing. Survival is the name of the game. My DNA demands it. Survival is the name of the game. Evolution demands it. If you're not trying to survive, you might as well just go and hang it up right now. Because this is about survival. If you're not trying to survive, just go hide somewhere. Because this is about to get ugly. Realism isn't. War drums is beat now. Warriors. Where my gangsters at? Out there with them gaps, always standing around, holding them shits, ready to bust them at your cats. Where my gangsters at? Where you cats that's not afraid to bust them caps? How you let shit go down like this and you don't even answer back? Not one shot. They walk around safe, choking you the fuck out. And then they stand right there in your fucking face. How the fuck is you tough? How the fuck is you real? If they do shit like this to you and walk around knowing ain't no consequence, you's a goddamn cow. That's why they do. They know they got you shook. And they ain't got the show and prove it. They just ready your one time. Get back up. And you motherfuckers just go back up. And y'all stand there, camera in your hand, filming the man getting choked out. I don't understand. Explain this shit. How the fuck did you stand there and watch that shit? And then you see that he dead. And y'all don't rebel. What the fuck is that shit? Come on, it can't be real. Fuck is your heart at? Fuck is you telling me? You just getting choked the fuck out and going for the shit. Now you got the signs out. No justice, no peace. And you walk around right in front of the beast. Snatch one of them motherfuckers up and choke the life out them fucks. Goddamn. Where your heart at? Where your motherfucking heart at? This bullshit. Don't come at me with revolution. This shit right here, right now. Survival, the name of the game, anyway, by any means. Malcolm told you that shit. Still, y'all going for shit. Bending over quick. Asking for fucking jobs. Welfare checks, what the fuck is that, y'all? Benefit cards. Come on now, shut this bitch down. Tired of this shit. Black man laying dead in the fucking street for trying to sell a fucking cigarette. And they gonna stand there and say that shit? Come on now. Market rule, taxation, this the shit you facing, still treating you, and you still walking around calling yourself nigga too, what the fuck is that fool, wake the fuck up, this shit real, fuck up, god damn it, don't be talking shit, revolution, you ain't about that shit. Realism-ism. You dying anyway. 
fuck is you afraid to stand for? You dying anyway. Ain't nobody getting out this shit alive. That's the name of the game. You live and you die. It's the way that you live, don't you understand? Stand the fuck up. On your feet. Fuck praying, cause that shit ain't doing shit in the street. Get your ass out there. And hold it down when you see him try that shit. Realism is 